Hello guys, the Exposing Ghost. Like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Today's topic will be Need God Net Exposed. Luke 6 26 warned to you when all men speak well of you, for so did the fathers through the false prophets. I'll sit there and request expose Need God Net. When I first saw him, I thought he was pretty solid on the gospel, but now I found out he is. Backloading works into the gospel, and backloading is far worse than frontloading. I'm about to play a clip and expose Need God Net, so here goes. Right, but all these rappers who wear crosses and just shake their booty, so whatever they do, it's forgiven because they believe in Jesus. No, most of them and don't they believe. Keep doing it every day. The fact Jesus indicates that someone's behavior will change if they do truly believe. There are plenty of people who claim to be Christians. But yes. the fact that they're living horrible lives probably just evidences they don't really believe in Jesus at all. They're just faking it. They're not saved. So they're not saved if, if they're like... I'm not saying you're going to be perfect once you trust in Jesus. But what I'm saying is that your attitude will change once you trust in Jesus. Instead of loving sin and thinking, I can swear it's okay, you'll actually find yeah. sin is offensive and you'll seek to avoid it. But secondly, you'll then begin to sin less as time goes on as well. But then he's going to forgive me. Why? Only if your trust is in Jesus to save you and not in your own actions to save you. So, according to Need God Net, if a rapper has a changed lifestyle after he has been saved, then he's not saved at all. That's the changed life heresy. And he is fully expecting people's lifestyle to see if they are saved. This is how a person is saved. 1 John 5, 10 through 11. He that believe on the Son of God had the witness in himself, he that believed not God had made him a liar because he believed not the record that God gave of his son. And this is the record that God had given us eternal life, and this life is in his son. Anyone who believes the record about the Lord Jesus Christ is saved no matter how horrible their sinful lifestyle is. God is not looking for a changed life to get into heaven. He is looking for faith in the only God's Son who died and buried and resurrected on the third day for the remission of sin. Need God net is mixing discipleship into the gospel and it makes it a work based salvation gospel. If I knew a stripper, every time I see her, she said that she believed on Lord Jesus Christ who died and been resurrected on the third day, then she is saved. Her lifestyle had nothing to do with her salvation at all. She should try and do the right thing after she is saved, but it's not guaranteed. She should try to start stripping and do some episode stripping after she is saved, but it's not guaranteed. She is saved because she trusts in the Son of God for her salvation. Not her stop stripping none of that there. That has nothing to do with salvation. She is trusting in Jesus Christ, not a foot the rags. And Paul warns us about people like me, God, Nick, who teaches another gospel. Galatians 1, 8 through 9. But though we or aim have preached any other gospel to you, then which we have preached unto you, let them be a curse. As we said before, so I say now again, if any man preach any other gospel to you, then ye have received, let him be a curse. And need God, Nick, is to be a curse, marked, and avoided. Because if a rapper really believed on Lord Jesus Christ at one moment in his life, he was sealed with the Holy Spirit because he placed faith in the Son of God. He could continue to rap all the way up till he died, but he going to heaven. Why? Because he believed the record of Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. Watch out people who is looking at people's lifestyle trying to prove their salvation. The salvation not about our lifestyle and what we do is about placing faith in the Lord Jesus Christ because Jesus Christ did everything for us. We do nothing. People's lifestyle has nothing to do with salvation at all. It's all about God and what God did for us. He died and buried and resurrected on the third day so we go to heaven. Not us trying to change our lifestyle because we had folks on change our lifestyle to be saved and we ain't trusting Jesus at all. We trust in ourselves. So, Mark and avoid need God in it. And anyone who is teaching to change like heresy. That's all I gotta say. May God bless.